Guys, thank you for stopping by again. And we made it. We did it. Time to say goodbye to 2018 and hello to 2019. And today is cooking day, December 24th. Getting ready for Christmas Eve. Getting ready to receive all the family. And getting ready to uh, have a wonderful, wonderful Christmas Eve. And I hope you guys do the same. So I just wanted to make this little video. And... Uh, Thank every single one of you guys for always stopping by, always checking my videos, and always being so kind as of giving me your attention. And wanted to wish every single one of you a very Merry Christmas, and I hope 2019 brings you the joys that you guys have always wanted. And as Omega and me wait for the, uh, for the guests to stop by, I wanted to share with you guys, I will be a grandfather next year. I have the new little addition to the family, something I'm very grateful for 2018. So as I keep getting everything ready for the meal today, I will show you guys a little bit about my personal trilogy. We all have three watches that we absolutely love. And I wanted to share with you guys the three watches that are in my collection. Instead of doing the state of the collection, I'll show you the three watches that are the most important to me at this point and I think uh, this can be very difficult to change as you can see my Omega pie pan my Rolex that you guys have seen a bunch of times on this and I never get tired of this watch and I just absolutely love it and you guys know how much it's uh, near and dear to my heart and one of the watches that I, I don't think I've shown you guys it's this Abercrombie and Fitch it's one of the watches that I've been wanting for a while the condition is not a hundred percent but it, it is a beautiful watch and to me once you open it that's where all the magic happens if you can see in the back case it has all the proper signatures with Abercrombie and Fitch and the movement it's something that just uh, blows me away I'll show you guys just an incredible movement it has an Angelos 210 it doesn't come with the Hoyer movement so to me, this is a little bit more rare than an Abercrombie with a Hoyer movement. It is just a piece that I've been wanting for a long time, and it made in my top three of my collection this year. You could have plenty of watches, but um, we're all going to have a top three in our collection. And guys, this is my top three. In most of my videos, I give you guys the usual sign out, and I thank you guys for stopping by. And I always say I'll catch you guys in the next one. But in this one, I will catch you guys in the next one. But I just want to take the time to wish every single one of you a very Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. And hope next year brings you all the best. Guys, thank you so much. I appreciate it.